There's a lot of wood turners in Wisconsin, many of them using old barns as their workshops. These can be ideal for a place to do wood turning. One such guy is Rob Nelson. As I've gotten to know Rob, I would describe him as an experimenter. He has tried a number of different things in pen turning and other types of turning. I'm extremely happy to say that Rob has chosen exotic blanks to help him market his newest Omni Ribbon. This is a blank that has ribbons that are hand placed so you don't end up with the blank areas. You just end up with nicely patterned ribbons throughout your pen. We think that this will be a real hit with the pen making community. I know if I had had it when I was doing shows, we certainly would have been able to sell it for very good prices. So stick with me and let's take a look at turning it and introduce you to Omni Ribbon by Rob. We begin with drilling the blank and as you can see with normal sharp drill bits this comes out in ribbons and it's extremely simple to drill. We're going to uh, accelerate the action in this uh, video so that you don't spend a lot of time watching me turn and drill and all those things but I do want you to see that this is a very easy material with which to work. Once the blank is drilled, it's just a matter of turning it. And like most resins, this is easy to turn from both ends. Uh, I turn the two ends off and then go in and turn the middle down. And that's the way I typically do most resins. Uh, this particular material is made of alumilite. Uh, there was some confusion early on as to whether it was this actually alumilite or alumilite like it is an alumilite uh, blank. So those of you who have turned the alumilite products understand that this is very, very simple to turn. Comes off in ribbons and virtually anybody can make a pen out of it. So as you can see, it's coming off in one long ribbon when I turn it. Uh, and I try to get it done relatively quickly here. This is double speed. This closer picture kind of lets you see that the um, material is very simple to turn. Uh, I'm not having any trouble with uh, high points or low points. It's, it turns uniformly. When you stop the lathe to look at it, you can see that the uh, markings are uni throughout the blank. Uh, you have ribbons everywhere. Uh, it's a random pattern, of course, but it really looks nice. And with, we sand it with 400 grit, and then we sand it with a 600 grit just to get it down to the point that there are no large scratches in it, uh, after which I take it to the uh, buffer and buff it with Tripoli and white diamond. Uh, it's a very simple material to work with. As I said before, it is alumilite. It's a black alumilite, so it's very simple. Uh, there are six colors at this point. Uh, we have black and blue and violet and red, uh, orange and green. So take a look at them. I think you'll find that they're um, really a beautiful blank to work with. I have turned a lot of commercial blanks that are ribbon blanks and some of them can be beautiful but many of them have great big large spots in them that you don't see any ribbon at all. And that's why I think this is going to be so well received by most of the guys who uh, sell their pens. It really is ribbons all the way around it and looks very very nice when it's finished. So take a shot at it, see what you think. This is Ed from Exotic Blanks. Once again I thank you for watching. Happy turning to you. Bye now.